burns and leg ulcers benefit from a quick spray. Recell spray on skin is a type of autologous cell harvesting process. By coating a wound or skin defect with a layer of regenerated skin cells, the healing process is accelerated markedly. Scar formation is minimized and tissue rejection is also avoided to a large extent. Pigmentation can also be reintroduced to the skin in cases of pigment loss and burns, for example, these features make the recell process of interest in cosmetic plastic and reconstructive procedures. The harvesting procedure enables cell processing at the site of treatment without the use of specialized laboratory staff. The process involves taking a small skin biopsy of about 2 cm squared. The skin sample is then incubated in an enzyme cocktail for about 20 minutes. Once processed, the cell suspension is available to spray an area up to 80 times the area of the donor biopsy. The wound is then covered with the dressing. The dressing falls off after new skin starts to grow between 5 to 7 days afterwards. In 2012, the Australian-based company, Avita Medical, obtained regulatory clearance for resell in Europe, Australia and China. U.S. and Canadian researchers had tested the spray on skin on 228 people with chronic leg ulcers. Leg ulcers typically heal very slowly and affect around 1.5% of the general population and over 3% of people over the age of 70. Management of leg ulcers using compression bandages heals about 70% of ulcers on average. After six months, skin grafts taken from other parts of the body are generally used for large areas which have not healed completely. Skin grafting is expensive and requires long hospital stays. In contrast, the ulcers of more than 60% of patients sprayed with Resell were healed within five weeks. Almost all patients reported an immediate reduction in pain within 24 hours of the treatment. Experts also claimed that faster healing could save money despite the cost of the spray. The National Institute for Health and Care Excellence has opened a consultation on the draft guidance for the spray on skin. Early thinking is that the resell system shows promise. However, they are waiting for the results of future research before recommending its use in the NHS.